Basic Concepts of Macroeconomics What is Flow of Production? Flow of production involves a continuous movement of items through the production process. It signifies that when one task is finished, the next task must start immediately. Therefore, the time taken on each task must be the same. Flow production involves the use of production lines such as in a car manufacturer where doors, engines, bonnets and wheels are added to a chassis as it moves along the assembly line. Capital and consumption goods, consumer durables and final goods. Capital goods and consumer goods are classified based on how they are used. A capital good is any good deployed to help increase future production. The most common capital goods are property, plant and equipment. Consumer goods are any goods that are not capital goods. They are goods used by consumers and have no future productive use. In economics, a durable good or a hard good is a good that does not quickly wear out or more specifically, one that yields utility over time rather than being completely consumed in one use. Examples of consumer durable goods include automobiles, books, household goods, home appliances, consumer electronics, furniture, tools, etc. Sports equipment, jewellery, medical equipment, firearms and toys. In economics, any commodity which is produced and subsequently consumed by the consumer to satisfy his current wants or needs is a consumer good or final good. When used in measures of national income and output, the term final goods only includes new goods. Investment and depreciation. If gross investment is consistently higher than depreciation, net investment will be positive, indicating that productive capacity is increasing. Conversely, if gross investment is consistently lower than depreciation, net investment will be negative, indicating that productive capacity is decreasing, which can be a potential problem down the road. For more such videos on all subjects, practice questions and a lot more, download iPrep and learn unlimited.